Hello again guys. I'm here today to teach you how to build a um, my differential in that movie I made, the uh, Gmod 10, whatever it was, but I'm here to teach you how to make it today. So, let's hop to it. Let's get rid of you. Okay, so, this is the not that big of complex uh, four slapper slapper engine. I know these slappers aren't perfectly aligned with the wheel, but yeah. Anyways, let's get to it. Now, here's what you do. You need four of these four of those Phoenix plate one by ones. And then you you gotta get these models though. It's called primitive mechanics. You gotta go to more gears and um uh, get uh this one? Okay, it's gear bevel eight T one. So let's spawn four of those. Let's four. I don't know who he is. And lift these up. Get axis out. Take that, axis on there. Take this one, axis it on there. That one on there. And this one on here. Then you take that one, you freeze it. Well, gotta freeze the gears first. Lift these up. You know, put them at like this. Then you can um, easy weld it. I like to do this because get oh, whoa, that was unexpected. What happened there? He crossed me. S silly gear. No oh, damn it. Okay, let's try that again. This on here. Get that aligned. There we go. Freeze that. You know, freeze these two years. See how it works. Oh, what? What? No, 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 no. 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 Let's try that again. Sorry about that. Try putting it there. There. Now you can freeze it and see how those two work. I need to take the next one, take that, and put it on that one. You know, this one here. Take this that way. Snow collide all that one. Or no collide all. And the final one, where did I put that? Oh, here we go. <sighs> that one on. Oh wait, no, that's no collide. Let's unno collide that. Take that there. That one there. You might have to realign them. There we go. Now you can weld them all up with whatever you use. Smart constraint, easy weld, or smart weld, whatever. I like to use smart constraint because it's more complex. I'll freeze that. Whoa. Oh, we got here. Oh, that's right. Gotta weigh them. 200. You gotta weigh them 200 or else that's what will happen. Let's try weighing these. 150 or 150. Oh, 150. There we go. Let's try that. There we go. It all works. Happy to do do. Okay, now to the next point. Now, in my other video, as you as you've seen, this whole box moves, right? So you gotta take two more Phoenix plates, gotta access them on each side. 
choose whatever side you want. I'm choosing these. Freeze that. Freeze that. Freeze that. Get these aligned. Now let's see. We'll put some. Whoops. Oh. Ooh. Almost had a panic there. I'll lift that up a little. Let's weld it together. That there. That there. And that one. Or this one. Then you can unfreeze these. And voila, it all turns. Now you can start adding your wheels. I like to use these because they have served me in the past very well. Yes, they go into the ground, I'll fix that in a minute. You gotta take ball socket advanced. Now Everybody has their own method. I just put uh, everything to zero except, well, no, I put everything to zero. Everything. And I mean everything here. Force limit, torque limit, X minimum. Put everything to zero. And just check free movement. Or you can use other people's methods. I don't personally do that because it's harder. Whoops. Put that on there. that up a little. Yeah, the whole thing spins. Yeah, I'll freeze that one, freeze that one, and that one works. Now, I'm sh I'm don't know if you've seen the uh, Big Adams four by four truck, but he uses a different differential. It's not completely the same as mine since mine you can take a lot more torque out of it as you can see if you do that I mean if you set it down with the engine on it which I will show to you in a minute it um, it'll start moving right away like as his it takes like about 20 seconds to start moving not blaming you Adam if you're watching this for anything but I'm just saying, you can get more torque out of this one. Because those gears will still move. Like, as you can see, that one stays still, and these ones just rotate around them. Whoops. See? Very complex. I'll freeze that one, and that one will spin. I'll freeze that one, and they both spin. Voila. Okay, now for the motor. Wait, hold on. Got a little bit of a problem there. Move that forward a little. And we can weld it up. There we go. Now, I'm just going to quickly make a non steerable, well, yeah, a non steerable truck. I just get to use thrusters to make this really quick. You can just watch my other video there for whatever, you know. Whoops. Okay, now. I'll weld this up. Here. And this to there. This to there. Here, wait. No, 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 no. It won't be aligned with the other wheels. It'll